Hey guys, we are here with Jessica Ryan, who has personally put all of this Broadway Unlocked stuff together and has asked Kyle and I to be able to interview um, all of the performers for tonight. So Jess, you know, how have you enjoyed putting all of this stuff together? Uh, I have enjoyed putting all of this stuff together quite a bit, but um, I did not ask uh, you to be here. You guys, I, I really don't have time for this. You're not supposed to be here. Please don't talk to them. Just go, just go. Isn't she the best? I don't know what to do about that. Oh my god. Here with Lilla Crawford, so she was we are. Annie on the Broadway revival. I must tell you, Annie was the first show I saw as a child. So it's like why I do what I do. Oh my gosh, um, that's so amazing! So do you I have any it. advice for me to play Annie? You definitely need the red hair. Doable. You need to try on some wigs. I'm ready. That's it's really the red dress. It it's the red dress. Ready. So get in that's costume. Easy, then it's like. Okay. You're singing with dogs and everything, and everyone will love it. I'm ready for it. Everyone will love Thank it. You so much. So Kyle, you have done all kinds of stuff on Broadway. You've done Next to Normal, you've done Wicked, you've done Pippin. But one of your biggest accomplishments that we know of, at least, has been that you were uh, in the BuzzFeed list of Smizers. What? Really? I feel pretty good about it, actually. You know, I've always felt kind of self-conscious about my deep set eyes, but now that I'm on a BuzzFeed list about it, I'm going to embrace it and run with it. Hey, guys, I'm here with Allie Stroker. Um, she, known for Glee and Spring Awakening, Death yes. West production. Yes. Um, the rehearsal process was stressful. I bet. But so rewarding and really exciting to be able to do that kind of show on Broadway. Were you like a show choir kid? Oh, totally. So show choir, show choir theater. basically means I'm ready for Broadway. Like if I did that. Oh, I'm ready. Since you did it. No problem. I'm You're ready. Go. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. We're going to put you in Les Mis tonight. I don't tonight. know any ASL, so you'll have to help <laughs> me with that. Thank you so much. Okay. We are now here with a performer who has spent her time dancing through life on Broadway. She's a very popular, the wickedly talented D. Rossioli. What was it like being able to perform in Pokemon Live? You know, my character really had um, a journey. I played the mom, and um, I really had to dig deep to, you know, let go of my son and, and let life kind of take over. Um, so it really was, uh, it called upon my keenest acting skills. I'm here with Joey Contreras, singer, songwriter, wrote the album Young Kind of Love, mm -hmm. which we all know the story behind that. <laughs> do we? <laughs> yes. Oh. You know about the Broadway power couple. Do you know anybody on Broadway now that has caught your eye? Maybe like one of the School of Rock members? Somebody in Matilda? Well, oh, oh, like, oh, like me. I'm so old. Everyone, <laughs> well, no, because I'm, I, everyone else is so young. Yes. Like everyone is like 12. I've got to catch them all. That's, cool. how, that's why I'm here. Love it. You have a very, you know, strong jawline. I have a question. What is the most dense object that you've ever been able to cut with your jaw? <laughs> like diamonds? I've gone in for kisses and have just murdered people before. Bloody boyfriends everywhere. It's too bad. <laughs> also, Into the Woods film, Little Red. How much fun was that? Oh, it was so much fun. Anna Kendrick, James yeah. Corden, yeah. Emily Blunt. Yeah. What advice did you have for Meryl Streep? What advice did I have for sure Meryl, Meryl Streep? You have some lipstick on your teeth. There was no like advice exchanging. There was no, okay. but but Emily Blunt did help me study for a Spanish test, and I got an A on it. What, so what? good for her. Um, this is my second time being involved, and um, I just really love the people that get together for this event for you know such a great cause and everything. And I love the space. I love, I don't know. It's a really great community of people to be working with. Well, I'm singing a song called "Holding On" by uh, Kate Kerrigan and Brian Loudermilk. And I had sung it before, and they just called and, and asked me to do it, and I jumped on it, because of course I want to be a part of this. I would never be where I am today without all the people along the way who were like, yes, yes, I want to help you, yes. First woman in a wheelchair 
on Broadway. Mm -hmm. How cool is that? It, it, it was and is still feels really cool. That's great. This concert is all about giving back to the community. Um, what are some things that you like to do uh, to give back? My personal favorite thing to do is working with kind of teenagers, um, especially gay teenagers who come from small towns kind of like I did. That's that's usually my, my, my go-to. Um, sometimes I just feel like they need a role model and someone to be like, hey, it's all good. So that's usually where I go. Uh, so I remade the Kylie Jenner um, interview magazine shoot, and it was really exciting to have um, a response to that because I really believe that the disabled community is ready to represent themselves. Yeah. So um, she created that image and I felt like it was really important to have an authentic representation of that image. So you're basically like a Kardashian now? No. <laughs> no. I don't wish that anyone. No thank you. The first album was a lot more of my contemporary musical theater material and now the second album was more pop focused. Um, it's basically like a very therapeutic album for me and I hope people can relate to it. Ohio definitely has like a special place in my heart. Ohio is a song about my love for Ohio boys. Super special. Mm -hmm. But I'm from Missouri. Okay. <laughs> so like I get that's hard to rhyme with. I'm sorry. I'm that's sorry. Okay. I mean that's I can fine. make a part two. Great. Yeah. I'm ready for it. <laughs> we had a blast at the Broadway Unlocked concert. Thanks to everyone who could give back. Check out our social media below. Follow us. Like us. Shout about us from your fire escape. I'm Kyle. I'm Carl. Keep on living the dream. Living the or that and then dream. <laughs>